If you like golf and you like drinking, well then you're probably pretty normal, but you might also love these. What's happening Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. I have in my hand here two tumblers. They're different sizes and they are really unique because they are obviously styled for the golfer. And so I thought we would take a close look at these because you might want these as the perfect gift for your favorite golfer or you might be a golfer and you just want to show your love of golf by drinking out of something that is useful and stylish. So let's check them out. So in many ways, these are just two ordinary tumblers, but the style here is one of these things where I see it and I'm like, duh, but I guess I never would have thought about that. But I just recently found out about these. Now, these are two different tumblers here, and I want to show you the differences between them because I have a favorite and you might have a favorite based on what you need it for. Now, first of all, I want to show you this is by Swig. Great name. You're swigging something. And they have a whole line of these, and they're the party line, like party, but actually P A R, like par, and then T, T E E, par, T. You know, it's so golfy. Uh, it's so punny. And one of the things that I really like about this one is that this is a 22 ounce tumbler. This is actually the largest they make. This is kind of your standard coffee tumbler, no handle or anything like that. But what I love about this is it actually has kind of a softer matte finish white. So it's not really truly golf ball white, like you know a urethane cover is going to be kind of shiny but i feel like this feels really nice in the hand it actually almost feels a little more grippy than the shiny paint here but what i thought i wouldn't like about this is that the dimples are so small and they're kind of spaced pretty far apart and i thought well that's not really very golf ball like and so it's going to be lost on me but i actually love the way it looks it's kind of subtle if you weren't a golfer you would still like this because the dimple pattern is pretty attractive and it does still telegraph golf ball design to me so i really dig that now 22 ounces isn't huge but it's pretty big this here is a 30 ounce it's more like big gulp size big gulps eh well see you later so i really like that now you can see here it has one of these polycarbonate tops there's a little flange right there so i can pull it off right here silicone seal right there so it has a very very nice seal then you can see a sliding lid right there and then we also have silicone underneath here so that when it is closed it really seals up that hole and when it is open like this it also gives you a little breather hole it says swig right on there so dig that you can see vacuum sealed stainless steel tumbler right in there and it fits the hand very very nicely now probably my favorite thing about this and you probably can't tell really but the bottom here is also silicone so if i tap the bottom you can hear it's nice and soft which is going to be nice one because it's going to be grippy but also when you put it down on a surface then you don't have to worry about it clanging every time you put it down which can be really annoying after a while especially if you have granite countertops or you work in an office you put it on your desk your conference room you're in a meeting so that is really nice i love the fact that that is integrated it's really well thought out so the swig here is really nice now they also have a bunch of other stuff in the swig line so if you want kind of the wine glass the stemless wine glass or the tumbler with the handles those types of things i think that they have a variety of those and they're not necessarily cheap but they're pretty nice now this i actually got because i actually bought it from phil mickelson's company for wellness.com where he has coffee for wellness and i really love this this is actually what got me on the kick for golf styled drinkware and what you can see here is to me the dimples are obviously much bigger but i thought you know this kind of looks a little more golf ball dimplish because the dimples are pretty close together again they're pretty shallow you'd have to look pretty closely i guess to say hey that looks like golf ball but you can feel them they give a little more texture there this is obviously a shiny paint here so i wouldn't call it slippery but it's pretty traditional it feels like every other painted tumbler here so obviously i don't have a problem with it but I also have big hands and this is a 30 ouncer so this is really big and in fact if I'm going to grab a big drink like an iced tea and just kind of nurse it for a long time this is something that I would want if I were going to have something like a hot coffee that's going to cool off over time and I don't want as much of it the 22 ouncer here I think is the better size. Now this I really love this finish and I was thinking hey this one doesn't look as much like a golf ball it kind of actually looks like netting or something like that but with that small dimple pattern I'll like this better it's kind of bigger more brash but I will tell you what i'm kind of torn you know i think both of these have their advantages and this one looks really cool but so does the swig i will also tell you that this is actually by sick so that's by swig this is by sick cups down in florida get sick yeah it's sick baby so they make some other stuff but i haven't really found 
mates to this style in a bunch of other products. Now this is very much like the big tumblers where the top is bigger, the bottom is more narrow, and it also comes with a polycarbonate top here, a little flange here to pry it off, another silicone ring in there so it has a very good seal, you don't have to worry about things spilling out. It has a slider lid right here, just like that, and this is all plastic, there isn't a, an additional silicone seal there, so if it splashes, you know, it's possible that you might get some leakage there, but I think it's going to be pretty minimal. Now, the thing I want to show you here is on the bottom, the difference, is that that is just metal, so there is no silicone pad on the bottom, so if I... Never touch Dale's drum set. So. What I like about this is that it's quieter, much, much quieter. Putting this down on hard surfaces, your desk, your counter, after a while, after the first couple of clanks with this, is kind of annoying. And I'll tell you what, when it's filled with liquid, it's muted maybe just a little bit, but when it is getting empty, it makes a lot of sound. And I've been experimenting with some aftermarket products to quiet that out because I think that's kind of a miss on their part. Now, what do I like better? Well, I really like them both for different reasons. And I really love the silicone or rubber bottom on this one. I will tell you what, this is the one I have been using for the most part because it just saves me from having to go back and refill a lot. But I would say that if I'm actually going to go into a meeting or something like that take up a little less space want it to be quiet this is the one i will grab because of all those aforementioned reasons and because it also does not look like i'm going into a meeting with a big gulp and that i'm going to be in there for four hours you know this says very similar size to someone who's just run to starbucks and gotten their venti coffee i actually am not even sure if that's their large size but you know someone who's carrying a premium cup of coffee will have something about this size this is just quite a bit larger but if you're going to hit the road then you want something with a lot of capacity so you can see here otherwise pretty much the same but man i tell you what if you're a golfer you like having all things golf you drink a lot of hot drinks a lot of cold drinks a lot of in-between drinks something like this is going to be your best friend so both of these i think are great and if you want either one of these i'll put links to them in the description below so that you can show off your love of drinking and golf and maybe not in that order peter von panda out we can discover more and explore so much deeper We can live better than ever things to Peter